Hey there, what's up? I'm Amkon from Kolkata West Bengal and in this video I will show you how you can double your CPU performance for free. It is not only for Windows 10 user, you can do this in Windows 7, Windows Vixa, Windows 8, Windows XP and any other operating system like that. So without further ado, let's get started into it. Before starting this video, I want to tell you that every processor which is come from manufacturer there is some redundant cells what is the redundant cell it is actually a backup of every processor course if your processor falls down and some cells damaged the redundant cell will be activated as soon and there will not be any lack of a performance manufacturer actually disable those kind of redundant cells to ensure the warranty period of this item but in general cases the processors are very rare to damage this kind of cells so we will enable those redundant cells and uh, double the cpu performance so let's get started into it to do this job you want to go to the windows start button and then find windows administrative tool there you will get the performance monitor it will take you to the performance monitor and then go to data collector sets then go to user defined and right click on this blank area and you will find a new data collector sets create a new data collector set i will name it processor and then select this option create manually advanced and then hit next then check this box performance counter and then hit next now you have to add performance counters that your computer will detect what you want to do with this data collector cells or add something now there neatly find the processor under processor tab select one one means the extra redundant cell that your computer can provide zero and one means there are two redundant cell in my computer as i'm using the intel core i3 4th generation 2957u hyper threading enable so that means it is a dual core cpu with two extra redundant cells now if you had an octagonal processor that means you will have eight disabled extra redundant cells and it will show you the seven numbers so select the highest value and then add it and one thing again go to process and then find thread count select this and add this hit ok we have done almost everything now keep the same the sample intervals for 5 sec 15 seconds and then hit next hit next you don't have to do anything and then go select this open properties for this data collector set and finish this once you have done this you have created a data collector set and the strongly recommended is to boot your computer for that and whenever you boot your computer for the first time the performance monitor will load the data collector set and it will active those redundant cells and it will really help you to play games and doing any other stuff like that it will really increase your computer performance maybe so that's it if you found this video useful for you make sure to thumbs up and if you don't find this video interested then make sure it turns down. Thank you so much for watching this video. Jai Hind, Bande Mataram.